January is Cervical Cancer Awareness Month, and a woman from Elysburg wants women to know about the importance of getting routine pap smears. She says it saved her life. Newswatch 16's Nikki Cries explains in tonight's Health Watch 16 report. Health Watch 16 is sponsored by Geisinger. Kathy Krepshaw loves grooming dogs. In fact, she has a dog grooming business called It's a Clip at her home in Elysburg. He's a barker, oh. a big time barker. Kathy got a call from her doctor's office in October 2021, which she says wasn't uncommon since she grooms most of the staff's dogs. But that wasn't the reason for this call. She said, you have cancer. And I said, well, um, I, I just, like froze. I couldn't understand anything. I couldn't hear anything else. All I heard was that C word. Kathy had stage one cervical cancer. She was diagnosed after a routine pap smear at the age of 61. Basically that pap smear, you know, essentially saved her life, gave us the diagnosis, led her to me, and then she received appropriate treatment for her, um, for her cancer. Dr. Scott Purinton is chief of gynecologic oncology at Geisinger. He treated Kathy. He told me that I had to, you know, have a total hysterectomy and have chemotherapy. He called it a sandwich treatment. Um, chemotherapy, radiation and chemotherapy. Current guidelines say women should start getting pap smears at the age of 21, but they may need pelvic exams before that. A young woman, she comes in, she's 21, has a pap smear and it's normal. She may not need to come back for three years, um, you know, if it was normal. If it's abnormal, then it gets triaged accordingly. Kathy wants people to know how important pap smears are. I have a lot of people at my age that say, oh, well, you know, I'm through kids, I'm this and that. I'm not doing that anymore. You need to have your pap test. You need to. Kathy is now cancer free and doing great. Nikki Cries, Newswatch 16.